Ooh. Hey y'all, thanks for stopping in. Appreciate you taking time out of y'all's busy schedule to stop in and see what it is I'm up to. I am working on trying to figure out how to make a kit using just your lighter. Now there's lots of kits out there that show using an empty lighter and you put all your stuff inside of it. it doesn't, that's not what I want. I want a lighter lighter and then put all the stuff around it. Now I started out, this is, this is part of uh, lighter 2.1. I'm actually going to put this on my keychain because I changed it around a little bit. I've got some duct tape, some line, and then this is just all hot glued on. Um, for this one, I've changed it around just a little bit. I've uh, I did I did a little bit different on the. on the ring and these are right at an inch and a half but I'm not going to do a whole lot of glue like I did on the other ones what I'm going to try to do is just glue these which came off of that other one I'll try to glue these on there and see how that goes Apparently, a permanent marker doesn't mean permanent, permanent. Pet jelly. The others can be red, sort of. Right now, I'm, wait, I'm waiting on my um, glue gun to heat up. Let's see what I got. Just enough. Don't want a lot. Just enough to hold these pieces in place. And we'll go with matches. Cotton. That one's smart. Cotton. And the magnesium. Put a little more glue. That one didn't work either. Okay. Cotton. And the magnesium. All right, we got those down. Now on the other side, we'll do some pet jelly. Dryer lint. And I think I threw away that hunk of string I had on the other one. Or did I? Doesn't matter. We 
little bit of flammable cotton cord. If I had a ferro rod, I'd probably stick a small ferro rod down in here. But if the lighter's dead, it's got a sparker, so I don't know if you actually need a ferro rod. I mean, I know some of y'all are out there, yeah, you need a ferro rod. Well, that didn't work. If I had one, I'd add one in. I don't happen to have one. But as you all know, I am not a prepper. I'm not a survivalist. I'm doing this because I think this is fun. Um, it's an exercise to keep my mind occupied. For those of y'all keeping track, we are on day three. And the missus is eating. The old miss, I mean, she actually, she ate an entire half a package of oatmeal. She's had uh, about a half a cup of Pedialyte and, okay, well that's about it. That's just, that's this morning. She's only been up about, about two hours. So, I am happy with that. Now let's see. This is some, yeah, that's some old duct tape. I think I can afford to. pull out a fresh roll we'll start that about there don't need that whole thing. Oh, I love the duct tape strips down so easy. Actually, Gorilla Tape. This isn't duct tape. Sticks to everything. This is more a protective cover. Then... It's not actually holding it on, of course, because it's glued on. So this is more of a protective cover for those tubes. And of course, duct tape or Gorilla Tape is flammable. So. There we go. I... This is version three point no. Yeah, I guess this is version three point one. Um, I kind of like that a little bit, a little bit better. Maybe I'll try carrying this for a few days to see how it actually works on my keychain. Um, all I need to do is take out the safety thingy and put it on my little blocker, but. I pull, if I pull that out, I'm going, you're going to be like looking me dead in the eyeballs. So, um, I'll just leave that sitting there. Hopefully, we're in frame. Hopefully, I've been in frame. There we go, folks. My keychain fire. Kit light lighter my keychain lighter fire kit uh, uh, let me know what you think give me a thumbs down or a thumbs up leave me a comment wherever you happen to do your commenting um, if you'd like to share me around on your social media uh, that'd be really nice 
use the new, new subscribers. Speaking of, shout out to all you new folks. I'm like 345 or something, I think. Um, uh, some of y'all pop in and say hello when you join up, and uh, I don't always say hello, but I appreciate you letting me know. I think uh, Murray was the last one, M E R R Y Murray, as in happy. Um, welcome to the Insanity Murray. There is a link down below in the description box to my Facebook page. There is another link to my nephew's GoFundMe for his hurricane relief effort. We need to keep those people in the forefront of our memories. Um, if you want to send me snail mail, the address is down below. I love getting snail mail. If your loved ones are nearby, people, give them a kiss and a hug. Let them know you think. Let them know you love them. If they're not nearby, give them a call. Let them know you're thinking about them. We're not promised tomorrow. We're not promised the next minute. But I hope y'all have a great day. Till I see y'all again. Slunchy, y'all. Bye bye.